We all know that selling a multifamily property is substantially more complicated than selling our regular house. For starters, there are a lot more people involved. Additionally, there are rules and regulations that sellers of these multifamily properties must follow to be legally compliant. And at utmost, you definitely don't want to be sued. Now check the tips that I'm about to share with you for selling multi-unit homes in El Sereno. First, you got to prepare the property for sale. An essential part of in making your El Sereno property sale go smoothly is ensuring that it's well maintained. Investors who want to buy will be much more likely if they see a nicely kept up multifamily residence and not worn with worn out carpets and peeling paint everywhere. The key areas to focus on while prepping your multi-unit property for sale include, among others, curb appeal. If first impression is key, cut back the bushes and shrubs, pull out the weeds, and some mulch would be nice. If the siding and trims need replacement, do so now. Doors and locks. It's probably well worth the cost to repair and replace the worn out doors. They seem to take on a lot of wear and tear in multifamily homes. Now the common areas. Very visible areas here. Pay close attention to them. Clean them up and repaint. Uh, make these areas sparkle, j just like this land. And parking areas. Usually low cost, low cost, high reward here. Repaint the lines and numbers. Next, you need to review leases and related documents. It is advisable to enlist the aid of a real estate attorney when dealing with multifamily properties. The legal aspects involved in selling these type of homes can be quite complex sometimes, especially since you need an understanding about tenant rights and other relevant information. Depending on what agreements were made between buyer and seller during the contract negotiations. You should know or at least be able to quickly retrieve the answers regarding the leases that buyers will want to know. Among other questions, these could be exact lease terms, right? Uh, each rent amount for all units. Does the rent include anything else such as utilities, extra parking, you know, what have you? And do the tenants have security deposits? Are any of the tenants with government necessities like Section 8, for example? Uh, then you want to use an, an agent with experience in selling multifamily properties. When selling a multifamily property, you should consider hiring an agent who has experience in this area. Top agents are important for any kind of sale, but especially so when it's time to sell your El Serene apartments. Most of us are familiar with checking the agent's digital footprint, websites, and, and etc. Now, however, a personal interview, you know, you should, is, is best. Now make sure you ask for the following. Ask for a previous multi-unit client that has that was represented on a sale and ask uh, how are tenants occupied properties handled? What are uncooperative tenants? How much notice do you give? Don't be shy and ask the questions necessary as that will as that it will greatly increase your odds of hiring the right real estate agent. So if you're trying to sell a multifamily property you know, in El Sereno, in East LA, Highland Park, just follow these tips and get a good price and avoid the risk of being sued. And if you're a newbie to selling a multifamily property, it might be a good idea to hire an aid of a qualified real estate professional. And that's where I can help. That's where we can help. Now, are you ready to sell that multifamily property? Just send a message down below. Give it, or give me a call, 323-494-3252.